All right, guys, what is going on? My name is Ollie Ward, and welcome back to the Ollie Ward channel. Has just ended at Brentford. Brentford 5, Leeds United 2. As you probably know, I wasn't streaming it today. I had my grandpa's uh, order of service because he died a couple of years ago, okay? And uh, who cares, all right? Leeds lost. I'm sorry, grandpa. I'm, I'm sorry, okay? Sorry, fella. But what is going on? Before we do get to the reaction, be sure to smash that like button. Let's try and smash 200 likes. Subscribe if you know all that good stuff. And just comment your thoughts on today. As ended Brentford 5, Leeds United 2. And it's really weird because I actually did watch the game today. I did watch the game on my phone while everyone was talking. Okay, I didn't watch it in the church. I just watched it back in the house. I didn't even think we played that bad. Obviously, the first goal was a penalty. It was a bit of a penalty that, you know what? On another day, that's not getting given. Sinister is unlucky. Tony puts it away. The free kick again to make it 2-0. Tony, lovely free kick. I don't even think it was a foul. Then we get a goal back before half-time. Sinister, lovely goal. He, this guy is brilliant. And we're seeing what this guy can do. And I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. Half-time, 2-1. We're confident. We get into it. Then it's 3-1. Okay, it's another Tony goal. It's an error. Melier coming out, rushing out. It's just the back four today looks so open. We looked all right attacking. I, it's annoying because I don't even think we played awful today. But the result, like just constant errors. And it just, it, it got to 3-2 and then, no, it got to 3-1, sorry. And then we got it back to 3-2. Rocker, nice finish. Lovely ball from Ailing. And you're thinking, go on. Then 4-2, then 5-2. And I tell you what, well, I don't know what Lorente was doing for that fifth goal or fourth goal. I can't even remember now, but he took the piss. And that's just what's going on. The back four looks so broken. It started with Cody Drama today, who I thought actually looked all right, to be fair. Look, I think he looked all right. Rasmus Christensen picked up a, a knock in training. But I'm really, like, I, I'm in a good mood, so I'm not really too peed off. You know what I mean? Like, I'm with the family. I'm feeling good. I'm happy. But... I just can't tell you what happened there. Jesse Marsh got sent off as well. I think we should get that as well. It should have been a penalty, I believe, on Somerville. I think it should have been. But you know what? Just stop running your mouth then. You don't need to keep running your mouth. You don't need to keep saying, oh, that should be a penalty. Fucking this, fucking that to the ref. Because you're going to get sent off. I thought most he was going to get a yellow. Sorry he got sent off. And we kind of went downhill from that. But... There was passages of play today that I was impressed with, but I know I can't be a positive fan on this thing. I know I can't be happy. We've just lost 5-2 to Brentford, and it's not a good result. It really isn't. And we go to Nottingham Forest Monday, next Monday, and, you know, we've got to, we've got to get a result. We really do. And I think Forest won today. I mean, the, the last time I saw her, I think they were 2-0 up. I, I don't know if they actually won. You guys have to let me know in the comments. I mean, the time this comes out, I would have sinned. But, yeah, I, I literally... I, can, I can't react to it because... We've lost 5-2. I thought those passages of play that were good, but defensively, again, guys, we're looking absolute shambles. Lorente needs to be dropped for next game. Koch, he played all right. I mean, Pascal. Uh, Tyler Adams, I love. I just do love Tyler Adams. Rocker to get on score sheets, good. Bamford, when he came on, looked lively. There wasn't too much wrong, just defensively. We just looked shite again uh, and then obviously you got the penalty the free kick goal the mistake do you know what i mean we did there was not too many times today that you could blame individual players like i'm not blaming sinistera for that penalty i'm not blaming anyone for the free kick because he's put it top bins the mistake was a bit of a defender should have headed it even the Koch the fourth goal he's headed it there i mean it's just again if you're going to point the fingers you point it at them defenders and that needs to be sorted out and then now we don't have jesse marsh for for monday's game against forest so who knows what's going to happen now, guys? Who knows what is going to happen? But this is just a quick reaction. I thought I'd get one out for you guys because I love you all. And uh, be sure to smash that like button and uh, comment down below, guys, because obviously I was watching the game half-heartedly, kind of looking down, looking at my phone, you know, interacting with family. Apparently, that's what you got to do. And uh, yeah, so let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Leeds have lost 5-2 at Brentford. And we've got, I mean, the start of the season is is now looking a bit bleak, isn't it? <laughs> it's looking a bit bleak. Let's just hope we can sort it out, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Get down there, drop a like, subscribe if you're new. I've been Ollie Ward, and I'll catch you in the next video. Cheery.